Hey, this one's in honor of my Uncle Mike, who's recently passed, and I remember once saying to me, Are you done being stupid? He meant it. Okay. Are you done being stupid with your gratuitous AI? What I'm pointing to is the way the animation runs around the input. It goes multicolored. It looks maybe exciting. Okay, let's go to another example. And this one was identified by Koi Manua. And it's one of those, what I mean identified, I'm looking at the same screen she is. It's just, she sees it different. And we have a quick example provided by somebody who sees it different. If I go to plan, I can find any part of this. They all have the same thing. This AI live plan assistant, every app on the planet's bound to one of these nowadays. Help me write. It's got the stupid Hello, how are you? And generate the draft. This here, this blinking cursor. Okay. Smart enough to start. And then the way that it animates in. Comparing this way of animating in and all of the stupid stuff around the side to the leader in the space, Claude. Claude looks like when I hit start a chat, I'll, uh, Uh, smoother and the way that that animates in it goes right and stretches the text box until its destination and that goes along with the text as it animates Now, these one, two, three, four buttons down here mirror what's down here. They have the plus and the minus. And this one has this action you can take on the word to regenerate it, edit the instructions that you've given it. This one here has a simple retry. This one has a copy, which is its action. The regenerate and retry, they're about the same. And we don't have the edit instructions button over on Claude. But we go back to this and will you love the code and that again asks us as people who care about what they make are you done being stupid i, I love you uncle mike rest in peace